Next, we are going to see about the fourth one. Uh, 4 into 0. 4 into 0, 0. 4 into 1, 4. 4 into 3, 12. 5 into 4 is equal to 20. 6 into 4 is equal to 24. 7 into 4 is equal to 28. 8 uh, into 4 is equal to 32. 9 into 4 is equal to 36. 10 into 4 is equal to 40. 11 into 4 is equal to 44. 12 into 4 is equal to 48. Isn't it? So, 0 into 4 is 0. 1 into 4 is 4. 2 into 4 is 8. So, we, now, we, now we have studied from 1 to uh, or, or we have taken 2 to 4 tables. 2, 3 and 4. We have been completed 2, 3, 4 tables. Isn't it children? Okay. So, see here. Here in the 2 tables. So, in the 2 tables. In the 2 tables, 2 into 4 is equal to 8. Whereas in the 4 tables, 4 into 2 is equal to 8. See here, 2 into 3 is equal to 6. Here, 3 into 2 is equal to 6. 4 into 3 is equal to 12. Here, 3 into 4 is equal to 12. The same numbers keep on repeating. Is it? It's over when it has a 2 times, we are taking the 4th table. When it is a 4th fourth, fourth table, we are just taking as a 2 times. Okay. So, this is how the multiplication keeps on working. So, when it, uh, when you fully, uh, for example, when you have uh, finished reading the second table, if you want to learn the next table, table there is a no change for 3 into 2. So, same. What is you have read for 2 into 3? The same answer will be going to be a 3 into six, six, uh, 2. So, what I am telling means 2 into 3 is equal to 6. Whereas, it is a vice versa. 3 into 2 is equal to uh, also 6. There will be a no changes. Okay. So, what they are telling? 2, 3 times means 2, 3 times means 2, 3 times means it is a 6. What you are telling? 3, 2 times means 3, 2 times also 6. Anyway, the answer is going to be a same. So, that is what I am telling. 2 into 3 is also a same meaning or 3 into 2 also same meaning. As like 2 into 4 is equal to 8, the same meaning or 4 into 2 is equal to 8. This is also same meaning. What they are telling, see here, here, 2, 4 times 2. They are telling if it uh, 2 comes 4 times means what will be the answer? 8. What you are telling? 4 comes 2 times means. For example, if 4 comes 2 times means is 8. Finally, the answer will be the same. So, don't worry about it or don't get confused about it. Okay. So, next we are going to see about the 5 tables. So, I don't going to concentrate very a big concentrate on a 5 tables because it is a very easiest table. Now, I am going to tell only the trick. So, we are not studying the full uh, fledged uh, tables. We are just uh, revising how the multiplication grid works out. Okay. So, now we are going to see about the how the 5 tables actually works. Okay. See here. So, 5, 10, 15. So, see here uh, in the one uh, series itself 0, 5. And next 2 series 0 and 5. Next 3 series 0 and 5. Next 4 series 0 and 5. Next 5 series 0 and 5. Next 6 series 6 and 5. So, this will be keep on going. You, now, you can understand. So, 5 tables means we want to start at 5, 1, 2 times. So, first one will be the 0 and second one will be the 5. Next, 2, 2 times. First one will be the 0 and second one will be the 5. Next, 3, 2 times 0 and 5. 4, 2 times 0 and 5. 5, 2 times 0 and 5. 6, 2 times 0 and 5. So, this is how the 5 tables actually works. This is a very easiest method to learn. 1 times... 2, 3 times, 4 times, 5 times, 6 times, 7 times, 8 times, 9 times, 10 times, 11 times, 12 times. 
okay so this is how the five tables work we just avoid skipping the count by five so if you feel very difficult to skip count by uh, five five you just take it in a one series zero and five in a two series there will be a two number zero and five in a three series there will be a two number zero and five four in a four series uh, two four zero and five five series two five zero and five in a six series two zero six or if you don't want to read about 30 tables you just skip it out the 13 tables you just taking only up to the 12 tables over. so this is how the five tables work working it okay so next we, we are moving to the sixth one Okay. Okay. Zero into six zero. One into six six. Two into six twelve. So see here, two into six is twelve. So I'm just taking two tables and six tables. So how many tables we have? Uh, Read it up to two tables. Three, two, three, four, five. See here what they are telling here 2 into 6 12 here 6 into 2 is equal to 12. Then if it is a vice versa but the answer is same. What is the behind process behind concept if the 2 6 times comments 2 2 2 2 2 2. If the 2 is 6 if 2 comes 6 times there will be the 6 will be the answer. If 6 comes for 2 times there will be the sorry 12 is an answer. If a 6 comes 2 times means that 12 will be the answer. This is a behind concept. Okay. So next. Okay. Two, uh, 3 into 6 is equal to 18. 3 into 6 is equal to 18. See here. 3 into 6 is equal to 18. What is the concept? The 3 comes for 6 times. So, 3 comes for a 6 times. The answer will be the 18. Or, if 6 into 3 is equal to 18. What they are telling? The 6 comes for a 3 times. The answer will be the 18. Okay. That every multiplication is a addition. Okay. So, next. 5 into 6 is equal to 30. Yes. We have a red. That is a 5 into 6 is equal to 30. The same thing. 6 into 5 is equal to 6 into 5 is 30. Next, 7 into 6 is equal to 42. 8 into 6 is equal to 48. 9 into 6 is equal to 54. 10 into 6 is equal to 16. 11 into 6 is equal to 66. 12 into 6 is equal to 72. Okay, so next we are going to read about these seventh tables, isn't it? So what is that? 7 into uh, 1 into 7 is equal to 0. 2 into 7 is equal to 14. 3 into 7 is equal to 21. 4 into 7 is equal to 28. 5 into 7 is equal to 35. 7 into 7 is equal to 49. 8 into 7 is equal to 56. 9 into 7 is equal to 63. 10 into 7 is equal to 70. 11 into 7 is equal to 77. 12 into 7 is equal to 84. Okay. So next 8 tables. 1 into 8 is equal to 8. 2 into 8 is equal to 16. 3 into 8 is equal to 27. 4 into 8 is equal to 36. 5 into 8 is equal to 45. 6 into 40, sorry, 47 into 6 into 8 is equal to 48. 7 into 8 is equal to 56. 8 into 8 is equal to 64. 9 into 8 is equal to 72. 10 into 8 is equal to 80. 11 into 8 is equal to 88. 12 into 8 is equal to 96. Next, 9th tables. 1 into 9 is equal to 9. 2 into 9 is equal to 18. 3 into 9 is equal to 27. 4 into 9 is equal to 36. 5 into 9 is equal to 45. 6 into 9 is equal to 54. 
7 into 9 is equal to 63. 9 into 9 is equal to 81. 10 into 9 is equal to 90. 11 into 9 is equal to 99. 12 into 9 is equal to 108. So, the 9th, you may feel, oh, 9 table is very uh, tough. It is a very easy concept. In tomorrow uh, class, I will tell you how to uh, learn the ninth table very easiest to form. So, what I have told you today, the 2, 5, 10. We have read the 3 tables, isn't it? So, this is a very easiest table. So, tomorrow I am going to tell teach you about how the ninth table works. Very, very, very simple. So, if you have read about the ninth tables, we are very uh, clear about up to the four tables. So, we want to be uh, concentrate on the remaining six tables. Isn't it children? Yes. Okay. Uh, so, today we have seen about how the multiplications, uh, uh, sorry, how the table supports a multiplication. So, how the tables are so important. So, what is the behind process of each and every table? So, the tables means the begin it's addition. For two six times comments, instead of putting a two for a six times, you're just telling it's a 12. What is it is meaning? It's we are skipping the uh, six six numbers. So, I have also have told you about the skipping count, skip counting method also. Okay, children.